anniversary. Um, when I heard about your 45th anniversary, I immediately remembered the first time that you came to visit John and me in New Orleans, uh, because when you left, you wrote us this very sweet note that said, uh, among other things, to keep taking good care of each other. Um, and I, I thought of it because I think that you're an incredible example of a couple that takes good care of each other. Um, but even more than that, um, you're, you're two of the kindest and most generous people that I've ever known. Um, and I see that you not only give so much to each other, but also to all of us in your family and to so many other people whose lives that you've touched over the years. And it's, it's just inspiring to see all of the good things that you've brought to the world together. Um, and I just wish you many more years of enjoying one another and this amazing life that you built together. And I love you both very much. Happy anniversary. How is a car could roll on its own? It uses its squealers. A car has no squealers because it squeals when you turn the wheels. <laughs> squeals and wheels. Hey, that was a rhyming joke. Oh. Uh, I can't believe you guys have been married for 45 years. It's absolutely amazing. Um, and I love you guys so much. I work with so many different people and so many different families and every single time I realize just how absolutely blessed I am to be a part of our family. Um, you two have created this amazing group of really fun, awesome people, and it, we wouldn't be here without you. Uh, so the two of you guys are absolutely amazing, and I've learned how to compromise and how to be funny and just find joy in little bits and pieces of everyday life, including cats walking across the camera. Um, yeah, I obviously didn't plan what I was going to say, <laughs> but I love you both so very, very much, and I am incredibly thankful to be a part of your world, and I am so happy that I have 
a, a large family to call my own and every single one is amazing. What else have I learned? Hard work. I, you both have shown just how, how far you can get with hard work and finding joy in things that you do every day, even the little things. I, I have so many fa fabulous stories from growing up, you know, car rides across the country with eight people and eight dogs and, or nine people and ten dogs, you know, whatever. Uh, learning to drive, old, driving across the Mississippi with giant semis on either side of me. Um, we've had so many fantastic experiences that are unlike any of my friends, unlike any of my students, and w they wouldn't have been possible without both of you. Uh, I'm incredibly grateful to have grown up the way I did with the people that I did, with the family, um, with my parents. I, you guys are awesome. You let us go off and, and do things that other people wouldn't have let their kids do. You let us major in theater, good God, and move all across the country and just experience life the way we wanted to. And I, I can't tell you how much that means to me. Um, you guys are awesome and I love you so much. <laughs> Arnold, Phyllis, I love you guys. I'm so happy to be a part of this family. Um, happy anniversary. Uh, I've set an alarm so that I don't uh, talk too long. This video is going to be kind of epic, and I want to make sure that everybody else gets their turn. I mean, I have so much to say, but honestly, I don't know where to start. I guess... Oh, seriously? I've gone through so many versions of what I'd like to say to you guys to celebrate your 45th anniversary. Some have been pretty elaborate, a few even involve Nita and I performing a finger puppet show. But ultimately, I keep coming back to the simple things. When I think about what a marriage is, I think about how you guys find joy and happiness in each other. I love that you guys hold hands while walking into church, that you have morning hot tub dates, and that you guys hop into the RV together and drive around the countryside to visit your family. I love that one of my earliest memories is waking up during a long road trip in Charlie and seeing you two just reaching across the gap between the front seats just to touch each other. You've taught me so much about what it is to make a lasting and successful marriage, and I hope that 43 years from now, Nita and I will be able to look back on our lives together and see that they're as rich and full of love as yours is. Happy 45th anniversary. I wish you guys many, many more years to come filled with love and happiness. Hey, buddy. Oh, that's a nice happy anniversary howl, isn't it? Only one more joke left. So, how do you get a lantern from in the sky? Um. You climb. You climb the sky. Happy anniversary! I love you guys! 45 years, that's amazing and incredible. You should feel very proud and maybe even a little bit cocky. <laughs> uh, I have nothing planned, no extraordinary, clever film for you guys, just my love. Um, I love you both so much and I am so grateful that you brought me into this world to learn and grow as a human being, to be challenged, to fall flat on my face and make these big, glorious and beautiful mistakes, and then, and then to have extraordinary moments. Um, and I just, I have a wonderful life and it's because of you. And I wanna thank you for bringing a slew of, um, you know, familial compadres also into this world who are extraordinary people as well and I'm just so I feel so blessed to be a part of this family and that all started with the two of you the two of you uh, meeting and getting married and deciding yes we're gonna do this thing we're gonna create a family and live in this world together <laughs> and I 
I want to say that your story has always been really special to me. How you met in Vietnam and how Mama followed Daddy to Germany and then you got engaged under the Kremlin and there's a part of me that wishes I could have been a little fly on the wall to, to see it all happen through, through your eyes and to get an understanding of the two of you as people before you were parents. Um, and gosh, what have I learned? What have I learned growing up? As a Morris, uh, <laughs> I've learned a lot about compromise, and I've learned a lot about hard work and devotion, and the importance of family, and I've learned a lot about strength from the both of you, and I've learned a lot about joy and the sense of humor and silliness, and about fully expressing yourself, whether it be with a laugh or you know a fart. <laughs> And I, gosh, I've learned that um, with marriage, you know, it takes a daily commitment to, to be there. You have to choose it every single day um, in the times that are wonderful and, and joyful and times that are challenging and difficult and there will always be obstacles and, and I, I'm so glad that, I don't know, I'm just, glad to see that you guys have chosen yes, yes to your marriage every day. Um, it's not easy. I mean, you know, you have 45 years to my five years, so you know. Um, <laughs> but it's impressive and extraordinary, and I wish, I hope that you two always, I don't know, still surprise each other, still have adventures together, still delight in the wonderful oddness of being two human beings sharing uh, the same space, sharing a life. I hope that there's always love and, and joy and that you you are friends and, and <laughs> oh my gosh, all this stuff is getting pulled out of my butt and I don't even know if I'm making any sense, but this is what I have. And um, I just, I wish you both an incredible celebration of your marriage. And I wish you guys 45 more years. I mean, why the hell not? I, I know how old you are, but who cares? Um, there's still room for adventure. There's still room for mysteries to be uncovered. To, there's still room to dive deep into the unknown of, of something new. And, and I hope you guys find those, those moments of, of just absolute glory. And um, let me raise my imaginary glass of champagne to you and say cheers to an incredible life, to having created seven people and, and the families that those seven people have created. And I think the fact that we are all awesome and the extended family is all awesome is simply a testament to your own awesomeness. <laughs> so cheers to you. I love you both so much.